In this video, we'll configure standard access list with packet tracer. There are three type access lists. Standard access list, extended access list, and name access list. With standard access list, you can check only the source of the IP packets. With extended access list, you can check source destination, specific port and protocol. And with named access list, you can use names instead of uh, the numbers used uh, in standard and extended access lists. In our standard access list example, we will use the topology on the screen and will provide to deny one of the PCs, PC2, to access the server and uh, we will allow PC0 and PC1 to access the server. Now it's time to configuration router 0. We will write access list on router 0. And our access list is standard. And here uh, we need to give access list number. You can use 1 to 99 for uh, standard access list and 100 uh, to 199 for extended access list here I will use 1 and I will say permit this is our wildcard mask oh, ok now here I will write like this yes I will also write for the other PC we are uh, allowing the traffic to bring through the server and uh, at the end of the access list always an uh, implicit try Accept these uh, permits, always deny all the things, uh, all the other traffics. But uh, to show you, I will write a deny here also for the other PC. You don't need to do this because there's implicit deny. Here, uh, this is the IP address, and uh, this is the wildcard mask. Uh, we will talk about uh, wildcard masks later. Yes. We have created our access list and uh, now uh, it's time to apply this access list to an interface. And for standard access lists, it is better to apply uh, this access list close to the destination. So for this configuration, we will apply our access list to the Facet Ethernet 01 interface of router. Let's begin. And we will write it to the out interface. Now let's verify our configuration. Uh, here, PC0 and PC1 can access to the server, and PC2 cannot. And let's try. As you can see, it's pinging. And for PC2, as you can see, it's pinging. And before the access list, also PC2 uh, ping the server, but now we'll try. As you can see, destination host is unreachable. The 10.0.0.1 interface is sending uh, this information because of the access list. In this video, we tried to configure standard access list on Packet Tracer.